Yo, what's up, what's up, uh, guys? Manzia, Pavo, it's your host, Signal Jemo Manzi, now on episode 5. Yeah, so let me present a show, Glingine, we want to talk about the ego of an artist. So, Manzi, we are going to talk about the ego Every time Manzi, we are going the usual faces and some new faces. So, today, as usual, we are going the mic to my left. Manzi, we are going to talk about So, always keep tuned, subscribe, like, comment, and share. Submarine, submarine, or say it's me again to make another group. So, Leo, we are talking about ego. It's a three letter word in a ego, a lot of demons up on that. So, we are just trying to dissect it's like, kuna kwa nga ile self actualization, as in how you want yourself to present to the public, like the image and you want to project to the people every time we show up, as in how you feel about yourself, you to the value you put to yourself as an individual. So that's a kuna kwanga na thin line between confidence <coughs> na pride. Ndo tunauliza in your own opinion, uneza define ego aje? Hello guys. Um, it's Bad Girl T over here. So today we are talking about ego. And he mentioned that there's a thin line between your confidence and the, your pride. So, um, ego is more of pride, you know. So, it, it comes from a self-awareness point of view, but sometimes it can be towards an exaggerated level, you know. It's your self-confidence, you know. Like, it's that pride that you have about the things you can do, about um, your actions, about how people view you. So, ego is part of yourself, your self pride, self awareness, how you undertake yourself. Yeah, but it depends on how you like, how you view it, how you perceive it, how you let it like drive you. Could be towards a simple manner or towards an, an overly exaggerated manner. Like ego can be both positive and negative no depending on how you <laughs> drive it <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah can help you <laughs> opinions, <Okay. opinions. laughs> hey yo my guys it's so my art come up i can say that uh, ego is a personality a definition of someone's personality uh, like for example you have an ego that ego will define you which character you have ego can define you as someone who is uh, stupid or someone who is clever, someone who is wise, and someone who is yeah. <laughs> but in a depend <laughs> because some ego in a in a bring you up in a inferiority complex. You see that person who is stupid. That person who is stupid tend to have that ego in the season can be washed. Huh? That's another level of ego. And then there's this ego that oh I can learn, but I have to keep my class. I think that's uh, according to me. Ego is on a two-part side, but it defines your character and who you are. Yeah. yeah. According to me, ego is ego is Before you figure out, when you are sent to the world, you have to do from a self-examination point of view. You have to self-examine. You have to threshold to check it I want to do this. You have to do for me this. Which government are going to figure out the ratio? I mean, attack, that's a much shake. 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 I'm still on stuck for your point here. Yeah. Difference your ego and like appreciating new wins, you know, no? Yeah, so me like ego ni added layers above the like, yeah. yeah. So for me in a quagga about twisted confidence. Ju end of the day it's about the confidence. Yeah. Una check it. Sure. Your confidence yako in a fuck or must to a certain level to say me, eh, so sa Ikipita hapa, you call it ego because kuna, kuna some element ya maringo inaingia and stuff. But guys, to go to objective about these things, 
so si kuna you call them principles kuna away i'm say wago na ji limit on the things you do ama your your thought line kuna things you can't go against kuna those rules wago so me ji say dia sindio alafu kuna kuna the authenticity of the person ile like enye ni waga ni jitambua na cheki as in just being self aware of the abilities you have as an individual na what you're capable of so uh, at what point do we start saying yenyewe it's not confidence it may, it may cross over to being cocky ama kukoa proud when does the confidence become too much yeah. okay so um an overly exaggerated self confidence is apply is applied or it can be seen when this person is the kind of person that um, his actions and his words are of an exaggerated form of self appraisal like okay you know there's that level of self confidence like kujamini like kujitambua it's like okay yeah I'm an artist I can do this and that but there's that towards such extents whereby you start despising other people at you no know, at your own expense like you you just you raise yourself above standards that are just so so highly exaggerated and you feel as though you're above everybody else around you you know there's a difference between owning and loving your craft and you despising other people's craft you know so like I could love my craft and love my work but still respect others but there's some people who like they want to be the only ones that shine you know they have that exaggerated form like I am the one I am the only one that is good at this and I'm the only one who deserves they feel like they are entitled to things that other people shouldn't have or get so that is where it gets cocky it gets just too 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 weird yeah. so yeah <laughs> If on a sema, if you're good at something, don't do it for free, right? <laughs> Sasa, if I knew Nikona these outstanding abilities about something, then I keep saying like see una acknowledge. It's like I'm an artist, nanajua, as in I do good stuff on my music. Is it like cocky for me to say like I'm a, I'm a, I'm a good artist, I'm, a, I'm the best artist as in to acknowledging that I can do something perfectly? Na you know like saying it out loud. You know pull if I can ego I say I'm a Yeah, I think I think uh it's a qualify kama ego. Me we have to see what thing and then we say that yeah, thing is legit, but yet another thing we want to. But if you keep repeating yourself, for example there is uh, oh my god, he <laughs> chama ring to on men. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got my point, yeah ring to on he keeps on saying that I'm the richest in East Africa. Um, we should see that shit. Yes. We should yeah. say, eh, we'll say, you're a flag. Naizi magari, maji, marangla, zizu, magito. And then there's that person who's so silent, but you see their work. For example, calligraph, like John. shit, yeah, John. You see their shit, unawana tunamogupa. I think your ego is uh, your decision-making. Decision-making, yeah. In a determine what type of ego you have. And stupidity or uh, can we copy your ego? Yeah. Or can we run away from it? <laughs> 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 yeah, man. <laughs> we still start within this line. Yeah. Uh, we're talking about ego. When you're talking about ego, for example, you're talking about ego. When I'm egocentric about something, am I doing this for people or am I doing this for people? Like for example, when I'm talking about ego, I'm talking about ego. Okay, I'm talking about ego. I'm talking about ego. I'm talking about ego. And then there was some another book on some extent and it's a big cloud in the kind of words and some manga. You know, when I'm coming to this point, yeah, I'm trying to separate between am I doing this for me or am I doing this for the audience of the people who are listening to me? And it comes to a point that I want to kill my ego. I'm killing my ego so that I feel good. And then at the end of the day, the end is once I feel like you're wounding my ego. Uh, I'm 
it's kind of bringing my work to some extent. So be it. Yes, yes I'm stupid. Yes, but I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not going to do it. 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 Ah, wow. So I know it's not good. Yeah. So I'm not going to do it. Kuna hiyo ni nini? Operating unaona? So like kuna hiyo venye si tunakujua. Kuna okay mimi nasema kuna good ni nini? Unajua kuna ile ego ya show me, unaona? Eh, na if unafanya kwa hii game everyone anafanya like every day unataka kuona some moves, ndio? So if e ego iko just on camera, I feel ni work than like kusha kusha hiyo both kwa camera na kwa ground, unaona? Eh like kuna feel kama ile time ya kama mtu kaki ya rajia anasema nyinyi mnahangaika unaona but kwa ground ana support msi anatoka pale mm -hmm. eh yeah. mimi na feel wewe mse kama ile time unaona kama mtu kama Vincent Mboya ako pale chini amekuja amekutusi for cloud sasa Mboya anainuka unaona so ina smart una, unasema wasi wanahangaika huko na kuna msi mwingine una lift ninge feel maybe eh yeah, now so. the ego inaweza kuja kwa ile point ya una ji uplift mm -hmm. lakini una downlift wengine eh unaona yeah so mimi na feel maybe my my decision to for you my thought eh yeah. uh, really. Hey, submarine tena. Hope muna follow us. Hey, the conversation is getting hot. Ya na tunasema inakwanga like a conscious decision ya mse. Whether uko proud, amuko egocentric, you know. Sindio? Yeah. Hey, sasa ju, okay, let's talk about standards. Because you can't be, you know, like everywhere, with everyone. Una <laughs> cheki. Hey, sasa what is the modest way ya decide where to be and who to be with without you know, like, could come off as being egocentric and stuff because, okay, kila msi utaka kurelate na the next person, see, our basic unit as human beings ni sociology, like, you, you just talk at some point, see, <laughs> yeah, but tunasema, your standards, how do you know if the acceptable thing for me kusema inye, I can't do this because it's against my norms as a person without it feeling like unajipake jina in a proud, you know, like, Eh, hey, Dimina, Makitukayo, anyone ideas? Okay, to a point, I'm going to be in the I'm going to be in the field. Like, I'm going to say, I'm going to about standards. Standards. Like, to go Me as a person, I want to be a way better person than I was yesterday. I want to be a way better, better person tomorrow than I am today. So, same goes by. Let's just show you how much you care. Maybe if I want to hang on to you, the kind, the kind of what I have, you shift. Kill us, kill us. Obviously, you would take a shift to the negative. Take a shift to the positive. The positive. So if you go in the near, if you go in the bull, come here. My dear, let's show you. I'm going to talk. Ten, eleven. So like, okay, I'm coming for you to offer me something, or maybe I want to offer you something, and what you are offering me. If you compare the threshold, you will go seven. I say you figure it out. I won't take that because I know my work at this extent. I'm doing this shit for me. I'm doing six, six, five. Yeah, to go there. I get. So like, if you get your offer, you're seven. I mean, I feel like I'm not going to go eleven. I'd be like, I'm doing it for you. So at the end of the day, you lose my ego, and maybe I feel like. True. I get. Okay, for me, okay, now it was the Mundia point. So my point of view ni first for feather, frogs together. So you have to be a star. 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 So when I'm bay, I'm going to be a star. So I'm going to be a star. I think point yangu bila mesema birds of the same feather that flock together. I think uh, from my own perspective which I targeted. For example, when the size kwa group ya wale inaitwaje walimu. Wanza kusema size oh mini artist. Itaka ego ile But when you go to the group of your people, what are what are you? What are leo? Una get. That's why unapatanga mse mwenye amesoma academician wale mwenye ameenda mpaka masters anakuja na kuambia hiyo mimi nimesoma mpaka masters nimeenda hadi hapa hata unajiambia huyo mse hapo na mazingo lakini akienda kwa academician so zake wanasema shit so i think with people and you have this threshold to make it as an individual but then these people who are up to is your standards and stuff or manizite principles so then what do you call it is it ni atini misfit 
Amama, what is the word? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, basically, when you when you own your craft and you have high standards, you're obviously like your your everything about you is gonna level up. Like you're gonna be of a higher class, higher elegance, and it's not everybody that's gonna match to that kind of lifestyle of yours. When I say lifestyle, I don't necessarily mean by money only, but there's, there's more about lifestyle. There's the way you carry yourself. You know, when you go to shows and maybe people can't reach up to you, that doesn't mean that it's a misfit, you know. Um, there's always people, yeah, just because these people don't find that your, your thing is good enough the way you want it, doesn't mean that it's, that it's worthless. Do not attach people's perceptions of you to the worth of your work. So you just carry your standards. If you know that you're good at something and you're sure that you're good at it and you match it with your actions, then just go on with it because people are always going to talk. Whether you're, you're rich or you're poor, people are going to talk. So if you attach people's perceptions to whatever you're supposed to do, it's always going to fail you. 